this is one of these projects I did. I have no real reason for it. It's a it's a post haul auger, and uh, I have a piece of wood. This is a handle I bought at some hardware store and uh, pipe tee fitting here. This is a pipe nipple I cut in half because I was I didn't want to grind this out and put in a bigger piece of wood. I just used use this to make the uh, hole smaller. Uh, this is a nail. Uh, I drilled a hole through here and stuck in a nail, split the nail and spread it out a little bit so it wouldn't come out. So it's just a pin. A uh, three-quarter inch piece of plumbing pipe. Thread it on both ends. Let's go down here and take a look at the business end. Uh, this is a three-quarter inch pipe fitting. And again, the nail with a split in it to hold it in place. Uh, the hard part, one of the hard parts was holding this thing square to this and uh, it took a lot of fussing around and measuring and whatever and finally I just trusted that this would be flat on here and welded it up, tacked it on there, checked it and yeah, the best I could do is, yep, that was it, it was good enough. Uh, okay, so I welded that all around. Then, you can see the point here. The point is nothing more than the extension off of a ratchet. I bought a cheap one because it's hardened steel and cut most of the top of the square square fitting on the top cut almost all of it off so it looks kind of like a big nail and I pushed it down through the hole there was a hole in the plate here pushed it down through the hole and put some washers in here to fill up the space tighten this down until it was relatively tight put the whole thing on a table and rotated it back and forth uh, until I got this point relatively straight uh, and then I tack welded it, checked again for straightness, and that was it, welded it up. Uh, put this thing back on the table, rotated it, and ground off the point, ground the point down flat. Now you're going to say, where'd you get this plate? Uh, this plate is slightly modified. I cut, cut some size off of it. But it's just the uh, auger plate they use on uh, guy wires on, like, telephone poles. So. I picked it up for about six dollars at a place that sells electrical stuff for for that kind of thing and sharpened up the edges I don't know if you can see it here on the camera sharpened up the edges on it uh, both forward and backward in case we needed to get it out of the hole uh, and that's it I didn't harden harden it I didn't heat harden it yet um, thought about it but um, so far so good anyway that's it for the project I hope you enjoyed it